no parent wants to bury and have to go through the process of burying their own child. That's not something that people, no parent wants to be in that position. Reverend David Green, Sr. of Purpose of Life Ministries, is devastated for the families of the three teens who lost their lives. We don't always understand why God does what he does. Uh, and let him be the source of healing of their pain. Neighbor Joel Williams heard the whole tragic accident at 1.30 this morning. As soon as I laid down, I heard a big boom. It was like somebody was breaking in our house. That's how loud it was. According to IMPD, a car was traveling south on Castle Boulevard when it struck another car from behind. They say the second car hit a third vehicle. Police say the drivers lost control and one or more of the vehicles struck the three teenagers while they were walking along the road. As soon as I got out here, they said that three teenagers had gotten hit and they think they all were dead. Reverend Green has been advocating for sidewalks along Kessler Boulevard for a long time. He wants it to be safer for the many pedestrians that travel on the road. We've got single moms that are uh, taking strollers and going down Kessler. And when you imagine in the wintertime when it's dark, many times through the day, they're trying to get to various places. Neighbors here in this community agree with Reverend Green. They would like to see sidewalks along Kessler Boulevard, but they would also like drivers to slow down because they see many people not obeying the speed limit. A lot of them come through here and they do not pay any attention to the 35 miles an hour. Williams says the worst times are at night. They have more police pr uh, presence over here so that you know you can you know keep up with stuff i know they can't be everywhere but just kind of patrol the neighborhood reverend green believes the teens would have had a fighting chance if there'd been a sidewalk here we needed to move up the priority chain we needed to be something that actually gets done is no longer just talked about on indy's northwest side erin control i just hope that things change for the better cbs4 news